What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. Okay, so, huh, we started off on the right foot, we won our 8th badge, we captured ourselves a legendary Pokemon from Unova, Kabalion, in the last episode, got ourselves a Mega Stone, the Mewtwo Knight X, and, uh, well... I, I think we should just continue on with this whole thing right here. So in this episode, we are going to be going into, let's see, the cavern, uh, the Nameless Cavern. Now, the Nameless Cavern will be holding one of the three Lake Guardians of Sinnoh. Now, this is the messed up part. This always messes me up. The way you can get each and every single one of these three Pokemon, it depends on the times. Now, let's see. From what I've from what, what I've gathered, if you want to capture Uxie, it is between 20 like 20 hours and 2100 hours, which is military time. So, if you guys want to put it up there, it would be 9 p.m. to 10 p.m., I believe. No, wait, hold on. I'm so messed up right here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. 12 Damn it. Whatever. 20 uh, 2100 hours and 2100 hours. Azulf, you can find them at 2100 hours from, uh, yeah, from, and three, what, three, what was it, what, 3.59 a.m., I believe, and then Mesprit, 4 a.m. to 19.59, which is, what, 7 o'clock? Around 7 o'clock, yeah, huh. Now, the, the messed up part about this is that I do have an Australian... I do have an Australian uh, game or Nintendo 3DS right here, so more than likely we might be we might not be getting all of the legendary trio right here if uh, I can't figure out the the timing and all that stuff. So I'll show you guys uh, I'll show you guys through Pokemon uh, Omega Ruby, which was the American version and all that stuff. And uh, yeah, enough of me babbling around. Let's go right ahead and capture this Pokemon. So let's see. We're talking Australia time. Should, is it like 12 hours ahead of us or something like that? I don't know. <coughs> coughing. I am coughing. So, the Nameless Cavern. You can find it right off of where Moss Deep City is. It's not that far. And we're going to be landing into this general location right here. That's right. Who, who cares about Fly when you can actually use a Lati just to move around right here? And... Well, as you guys can see, this is the Nameless Cavern. Come here three times, you will be able to find yourself one of the legendary trio. And, uh, well, let's see. There is the sign. All we need to do is find the Pokemon. Let's go ahead and save this game because, well, <clears throat> yes, we don't, need, uh, we don't need a fail. Now, another thing, too, is I'm going to switch out to Latias because... It does have Dragon Breath, and I don't want to... Well, I want to paralyze this Pokemon. So, a mysterious floating ring floating in the air. Something visible in the, in the hole. Yes, put your hand in the hole. And what we'll find right now is... Well, would you look at that? Mesprit. So, let's see. Mesprit. If I remember, which I don't. Mesprit is usually the Pokemon that I, I have the hardest time finding. I think in the last walkthrough, the Omega Ruby walkthrough, yeah, I had a hard time finding this Pokemon. So it is officially 4 a.m. to 1959. So no, this is the Pokemon that you can actually find the most. So let's go right ahead and just try and capture this Pokemon. Now, Amesprit is a pure psychic type Pokemon. And yes, it's going to be messing me up, but... Dragon Breath is the the situation right here, so I can paralyze this Pokemon, and I just need to make sure that like I I, uh, I need to make sure that this Pokemon lasts until it you know well, what's his name gets paralyzed and all that stuff. So here we go, Dragon Breath, Stinky Breath, still not paralyzed. Come on, man. Here we go again. So first all an attack. Here we go. Come on. There we go. You are now paralyzed. Okay, so let's see. We can recover. You know what? Let's go with another Dragon Breath just to see what actually happens right here. So here we go. Dragon Breath for the win. And no, this Pokemon is still paralyzed. So let's go ahead and continue. 
Of course, you know, we're going to get hit with a future site at some point. And here comes Charm. This is going to... Yeah, so we're going to get hit with a future site. And that is not effective, but it ha you know it helps us survive just a little bit. So here we go. Dragon Breath. And that puts Mesprit in the red right there. Alrighty. Okay. So let's go right ahead and try and capture this Pokemon. We have quite a few timer balls, but I'm going to start off with an Ultra Ball right here. And come on. Oh, wow. This Pokemon is not going to go easily. So here comes an extra sensory. And this is going to mess us up. But luckily for us, we do have Recover. So let's go ahead and use that. So here we go, recover, and that nearly fills up, yeah, okay, it nearly fills up our HP, and, well, let's go right ahead and use another timer ball. Hopefully this will actually work out, okay, come on, get in the ball, stay in the ball, come on, don't be lame, don't be lame, damn it, okay, so there's that, and, well, here comes another charm, so that's not, yeah, that's not going to do anything for us. And, well, here we go again. Another timer ball. Please stay in the ball. Probably should have bought more timer balls while I was at it. And... Okay, so... Let's see. Let's see. Let's go right ahead and use another timer ball. Come on. Come on. Stay in the ball. Don't be lame. Oh, my God. Okay. So, let's see. Yeah, we can't. Our attack, our physical attack can't go down any lower. So let's go right ahead and do this again. Another timer ball. We got plenty of Pokeballs, but the thing is, good gravy. You know, we, we, we need to prepare. And, uh, oh my god. So, still paralyzed. This guy will not. Yeah, it's not going to go. <laughs> it's not going to go down that easily. So let's go right ahead and let's see. We got 10 timer balls. We could do this again. Come on. Come on. Come on, stay in there, stay in the ball, be cool. Damn it. Okay, still not cool. Anywho, uh, here comes another lucky chance, and that is, uh, you know, I wish we could use that. I wish we could use that just to, you know, capture this Pokemon with a Pokeball and all that crud. So here we go again. And come on. Oh, God. Okay. So let's see. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, this Pokemon is not letting us have him. So let's go ahead and try it again. Come on. Timer ball, help me out. It's kind of like I'm trying to be lucky kissing the ball, and it's just, it's not, yeah, I'm not good luck right now. Especially with, a, you know, everything else. And, well, come on. Don't be lame. Come on. Come on. Stay in there. Ugh, I might have to go with the... I might have to go with the, uh, the the Ultra Balls right here. Or hit it with one more Dragon Breath. I could do that. I don't know. What do you guys think? Nah. Lucky Chan's going to just mess me up right here. And there it is. Yes, throwing out the peace sign, guys. I am throwing out peace signs. Okay. So, there we go. We caught ourselves another legendary Pokemon. And... Well, let's go right ahead and see what this Pokemon's all about. Here we have Mesprit, the emotion Pokemon. It sleeps at the bottom of the lake. Its spirit is said to leave its body to fly at the lake's surface. Hmm, it's pretty cool, pretty awesome. So let's go right ahead and just not nickname this Pokemon. And, well, that right there is, uh, well, one of the late guardians. I can't say that I will be able to capture every single one of them, but hopefully, you know, from time to time, I will be able to find them and all that stuff. Remember in the last walkthrough, I had a, I had a very, very hard time just trying to find just, like, one. Hell, I had to do a pre-recording of it, I think. I don't know. So, anywho, guys, that right there is pretty much it for this episode. Yes, I know, very short, but... Hey, hey. You know, I, I kind of wanted to, like, spread it out just a little bit, especially with, like, the new Pokemon that we're going to be finding around here. Prolonging it just a tad bit. I know. I'm having a little... 
I'm having a little bit of fun doing this, guys. Remember, been off for a whole month. Didn't really like life, but I'm enjoying this. So, in the next episode, guys, we're going to be taking a tour of uh, waterfall places. So, thank you guys again for watching. Thank you guys again for all the well wishes and everything else. I will be back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire walkthrough. See you guys.